So this question looks like it's going to be a translate word problem question, TWP. I say that because translate word problem questions are typically four or more lines long. So we want to use this strategy for longer questions on the SAT. And really the strategy is pretty simple. Um, it does take some work, however, it's a, but it's pretty simple nonetheless. And all it means is that you're going to read a single sentence at a time, making sure to translate or write down any quantitative information as you see it. Um, the goal is that you don't have to go back and reread this passage at all. So let's see how it works in action. The first sentence says, a scientist studying the life cycle of dragonflies counted the number of dragonflies in a certain habitat each day for 46 days. I'm just write down 46 days, right? I, I remember what's going on during those 46 days. I'm gonna just write that number down. Next sentence, on February 15th, so 2.15, there were 99 dragonflies in the habitat. All right, so 99 dragonflies. The percent increase in the number of dragonflies in the habitat from January 1st to February 15th. So from 1, 1 to 2, 15, the percent increase was 12.5%. Okay, so that means we're gonna go up. So I'm, that's what how I represent percent, or that's how I represent increase. We're gonna go up by 12.5%. But let me stop there. So we were given this 99 total dragonflies that were counted on the 15th. And then we were told that the number on that day basically was a 12.5% increase from the number it was on the 1st of January. I can use that to make an equation. So I'm saying the 1st of January was X. I don't know what that number was. But then I add it to that 12.5% of X, right? So I add it to that, I could say uh, 0.125 X. And after adding that percentage increase, I know that, the, that I should have a value that's equal to 99. So there is the translation for those first couple of sentences to represent the information that's been provided. The next sentence says, how many dragonflies were in the habitat on January 1st? Exactly, this, the X value represents the number of dragonflies in the habitat on January 1st. And now I just have an equation I can simplify. So X plus 0.125X is 1.125X equals 99. From there, we're just dividing both sides of our equation by 1.125. So that's gone, that's gone. I'll switch colors here. So we have X is equal to, go to my calculator, what is 99 divided by 1.125? That answer is 88. So the correct answer here is choice A.